Tokyo Sky Tree is the tallest tower in the world with a height of 634 meters certified by Guinness World Records. Today I will be visiting with her on a sunny autumn Sunday to guide you. Today's sightseeing line will first pass through Solomachi, then view the 350 meters observation deck, then go around the 450 meters observation corridor, and finally get off to introduce the aquarium on the fifth floor. Let's go. Tokyo Sky Tree was completed on February 29, 2012, and opened as a radio tower and tourist facility on May 22, 2012. When you leave the station, you will see the shopping facility Solomachi in front of you. There are many shops, but we would like to take some time to take a closer look on another day when we are shopping. We are going to the observatory today, so we will look at it appropriately. We arrived at the entrance of Sky Tree through the aisle. After all it is beautiful and splendid. Touch the ticket at the ticket gate to enter. By the way, it's cheaper to buy tickets online the day before. We bought a set ticket for two observatories and an aquarium. That is cheaper. As soon as you enter, you are waiting for your turn to take the elevator to the deck. It's not so crowded today. It's in the elevator. It's a little dark, but there is music and voice guidance, so I arrived in no time. We arrived at the 350 meters tembo deck. After all it is fine and the sky is beautiful. Let's turn slowly.
rising 350 meters above the ground, the Tokyo Skytree Tembo Deck, 350 meters, is covered in huge 5 meter high glass for a 360 degree panoramic view, allowing visitors to see from the base of Skytree up to 70 kilometers away in the distance. Sumida River is visible in front of you. In the summer, a fireworks display is held on the Sumida River, and eating on a houseboat and sightseeing along the river is one of the things you can do in Tokyo. W1SH Ribbon is the spot for making wishes whose name reflects Tokyo Skytree ranked number one as a freestanding broadcasting tower for its height in the world. At this special spot, write your number one wish on the ribbon, then, tie your ribbon to the W1SH Ribbon Monument to make your wish come true. The painted folding screen, Edo Hitomizu by Obu by Edo period artist Keisaku Wagata is similar to the view from Tokyo Skytree. Match the view outside with the folding screen and imagine the town as it was in the Edo period. Take the elevator to the observation corridor above. The Tokyo Skytree Tembo Galleria, 450 meters, will take you from the floor 445 to Skytree's highest floor 450 via a glass tube. The Tokyo Skytree Tembo Galleria, 450 meters, will leave you convinced you that you are walking in the sky. This is the only place where you can see the city of Tokyo from the sky at 360 degrees. This town, where 140 million people live, is so crowded. It may be the most densely populated area in the world. It's best to have a panoramic view here on a sunny day.
This is Sumida River. The tall buildings are Ropongi Hills and nearby buildings. Skyscrapers are concentrated in Tokyo due to height restrictions. There are many single-family homes in other places. The Sugai view is beautiful. Let's get off at the elevator. Let's go around the Skytree shop. If you want to buy souvenirs, you should buy them here. We came to the aquarium on the fifth floor. The aquarium is a popular spot. So if you come to Skytree, you should definitely see it. It is open until 8 p.m. But the last admission time is 7 p.m. Please turn around in time. The aquarium built on the concept of the cradle of life, water and what it nurtures. Here you can experience up close living creatures and the water that nurtures them while in the city. This aquarium is full of highlights, such as the Tokyo tank, where colorful schools of fish swim about an aquarium themed on the seas of the Tokyo Islands. 
The Indar open pool, where you can see penguins and fur seals up close. And the jellyfish kaleidoscope tunnel, with 50 meter long sloping walls and a mirrored ceiling. At the lab, a place of communication between visitors and aquarium staff. Expand the ways you enjoy the aquarium while deepening your understanding of these sea creatures.
In this lab, the state of growth from the birth of jellyfish is open to the public. It is an area where you can witness the wonders of life. It is also a place where you can enjoy and grow your interest and curiosity about living things. You can talk with the breeding staff, so feel free to ask if you have any questions. Today's sky tree trip is about to end. How is it? If you have any questions, please write them in the comments. Next, we will introduce the Ropongi area, so please look forward to it. Thank you for your viewing.